I don't know if I ever told you, there was a very nice um, Armenian couple that lived about a mile from us when we were in Karmatar. That's the early place where I lived. And um, he was the district judge, very nice man. And our, where we lived, our railroad station was just a stop. There was nothing there, but the one station up, there were good shops and you could get stuff. And he, his wife used to go up there once a month or so and do shopping and come down. And she used to ride in one of these funny little, we call them dandies, but it's, it's, it's like a chair with a cover on it and four guys carry it, you know, on poles. But something happened and it got upset and she fell off of it. And my dad happened to be up there doing something. And he saw her and rescued her and helped her and all of that. And uh, got acquainted with the district magistrate, who was a very nice man. And he did a lot of help with our Indian people who were being cheated by a lot of people or mistreated. And so the kind of providential that he met the lady, otherwise probably their social standings were so different, they probably would never have met because the judge would probably not have met a missionary particularly. And so whenever he had trouble after that with any of his people that spoke Santali, he would call dad because dad could explain and do the explanation. And when we moved to the next place, our government official found out that dad was useful. And so anytime there was a problem with that particular tribe, my father did his work. So his missionary work was quite varied. <laughs>